हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ चमेली देवी इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ फार्मेसी इंदौर सो टुडे आई एम हियर अगेन विद सस्पेंशन पार्ट थ्री सो इन दिस टॉपिक वी विल डिस्कस द मेथड ऑफ प्रिपरेशन ऑफ सस्पेंशन लेट सी सो एज वी हैव डिस्कस्ड इन अर्लियर वीडियो सस्पेंशन आर बाई फिजिक लिक्विड डोजिस फॉर्म इन विच सॉलिड इज सस्पेंडेड इन लिक्विड फॉर्म और लिक्विड मीडियम सो ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ दिस टाइप ऑफ सॉलिड्स द सस्पेंशन आर डिवाइडेड इन टू फोर टाइप्स अकॉर्डिंग टू इट्स मैथड ऑफ डिस्पेंसिंग फर्स्ट इज सस्पेंशन कंटेनिंग डिफ्यूजल सॉलिड्स सेकेंड इज सस्पेंशन कंटेनिंग इन डिफ्यूजल सॉलिड्स थर्ड इज सस्पेंशन कंटेनिंग प्रेसिपिटेटिक फॉर्मिंग और पुअरली वेटेबल सॉलिड्स एंड the last one is suspension produced by chemical reaction now the suspension containing diffusible solid so these are certain insoluble powders or soluble which are light in weight and easily wettable on that reason they are readily mixed with water and remain suspended throw out the liquid for sufficient long time after shaking so such substances are known as diffusible diffusible solids so example of these diffusible solids are calcium carbonate light kaolin light magnesium carbonate magnesium trisilicate now the method of formulation of suspension containing diffusible solids so these steps are first of all finely powder the solid ingredient and then mix the insoluble powder in a motor and add in a vehicle to make a smooth paste add any non volatile solid ingredient in part of the vehicle and mix well add any volatile solid ingredient previously is dissolved in the sum of the vehicle and mix well add any liquid ingredient and rinse the motor and pistol with successive volume of vehicle until they are quite clean transfer the rinsing to the bottle add more of vehicle to produce the required volume and mix through thoroughly by shaking the bottle now the suspension containing indivisible solids so indivisible substances are those substances which do not dissolve in water or vehicle and do not remain evenly distributed in the vehicle for long time or for sufficient time so formulation of these type of in indivisible solid containing suspension increases the viscosity of the vehicle by adding thickening agent tragacanth powder and tragacanth mucilage is used as thickening agent in the formulation of suspension containing indivisible solids example of indivisible solids are aspirin chalk powder phenobarbital now the formulation of suspension containing indivisible solids so as we know indivisible solids are don't dissolve and do not remain suspended in a vehicle so to rectify this problem viscosity of suspension is increases by the addition of thickening agent so tragacanth powder and tragacanth mucilage is used as a thickening agent or suspending agent for the formulation of suspension containing indivisible solids so tragacanth powder mainly used suspending agent for this type of preparation uh, the amount or concentration of tragacanth is required in the formulation 2 g per 100 ml of suspension and the tragacanth mucilage is used in the ratio of 1/4 of the volume of the suspension so tragacanth mucilage is used when vehicle is chloroform water or chloroform water and water because if 
mucilage drug canth mucilage is added in the formulation or preparation of medicinally active vehicle so mucilage replace medicinally active vehicle thereby decreasing their therapeutic activity so in such cases drug canth powder must be used as a suspending agent now the general method of preparation of indivisible solid containing suspension using compound drug canth powder so first of all finely powder all the ingredients so take finely powder of indivisible solid particle in a mortar mix them together in a mortar and add the any diffusible solid or soluble solid then add drug canth powder or mucilage and mix thoroughly so we will add 2% drug canth powder of the suspension then measure the 3/4 or sufficient vehicle to produce a smooth cream or a smooth paste examine the suspension carefully and if it is contain any foreign particle then throw uh, filter through a muslin cloth and after filtration then add more vehicle to make up the volume and transfer into the container now the suspension containing poorly wettable solids so some solids or some sub substances are like sulfur hydrocortisones are both insoluble in water and poorly wetted by it so those are produce clumps due to form uh, produce clumps and it is difficult to disperse in aqueous liquid these also produce foam on shaking because it is stabilized by the film of unwetted solid at the liquid or air interface so suspension containing these poorly wettable solids formulation we have to require the addition of wetting agent so let's discuss the method of preparation now the method of preparation so following steps are involved in the formulation of suspension containing poorly wettable solids so on that reason we have to add satisfactory wetting agent so wetting agents are the substances which which reduce the interfacial tension between the solid and liquid so wetting agent must be able to reduce the interfacial energy between solid and liquid those agent or those wetting agents ad adsorb at the solid liquid interface in such a way that the affinity of the particle for the surrounding medium is increased while the interparticular force are decreases and the example of these type of formulations are alcohol is used as a wetting agent in the formulation of drug canth mucilage glycerin and glycerol in sodium alginate quelia extract have been used in sulfur lotion now the suspension produced by chemical reaction so in this type of preparation of suspension the highly diluted solutions of reactant are mixed together so as to form very finely divided precipitate that can be easily distributed throughout the liquid by moderate shaking so the precipitate so form are diffusible in nature hence there is no need of adding any suspending agent so example of this suspension uh, produced by chemical reaction is zinc sulfate lotion bpc so zinc sulfate lotion is simply formulated by addition of all the ingredient and dissolve in vehicle by stirring and then make up the volume and transfer into the bottle thank you